This is Russell Hawley from the Tate Geological Museum. I'm the education specialist here. And today, I'm going to introduce you to Nicole, our uh, newest dinosaur fossil. Nicole was discovered just a little bit northeast of Casper, right here in Natrona County. Um, the first part was found by Dr. Kent Sindel, and uh, the first part that he found was the horns of the animal. And uh, naturally, he figured that it was a Triceratops, because they look just like Triceratops horns. But Triceratops wasn't the only big-horned dinosaur running around in Wyoming at the end of the Cretaceous period. There was another one called Taurosaurus, and the biggest difference between the two is in the frill, this big bony armor shield that grows out of the back of the skull to protect the neck. In Triceratops, the frill is very short and very thick and solid, but in Taurosaurus, it's much longer and thinner, and there are a pair of large holes under the skin in the bone, presumably to make the frill lighter. Now, when we started finding Nicole's frill, we named her Nicole after the landowner's daughter, we found that Nicole has a long, thin frill with a pair of large holes in the bone under the skin. And that showed us that we had not found just another Triceratops, but Taurosaurus. That got us pretty excited. Hundreds of Triceratops skulls have been found over the years, but only eight Taurosaurus skulls have ever been found. So it's a very rare dinosaur. Also, trivia fans, Taurosaurus has the largest head of any dinosaur, indeed, of any land animal that's ever lived. 